Toronto is Canada's biggest city and it has some big time vegan food. It's everywhere. From the corner hot dog stands offering veggie dogs to the multitude of ethnic restaurants to the numerous all vegan establishments, vegans eat well in this town. I'm Jasmine Singer from Our Hen House and today we're going to focus on a few vegan hotspots that you won't want to miss on your next trip to Toronto. Let's go. I'm so excited that today I'm being joined by two fabulous local vegan activists, Carl Orzakowski and Joanne MacArthur, who are going to show us the ins and outs of Vegan Toronto. Thanks for joining us, you two. Thank you for having us. We're here today at Green Earth Vegan Cuisine, which is going to start our Vegan Toronto fabulous tour. And we just ordered a whole bunch of food that I intend to eat all of. And if you're lucky, I'll share some with you. Sounds good. <laughs> Hello. I love you, won't you tell me your name? You wanna drink it? Mmm. Uh -huh. Mmm. Mm. Wow. So this is our quinoa sushi. That's I can't sushi. believe I've never thought of making quinoa sushi before. I've never thought of it, I have to say. I think we should do a quinoa sushi toast. Yes. Quinoa sushi, quinoa sushi, quinoa Cheers. sushi. Cheers. Cheers. So Joanne, what did you think of Green Earth? I love going there and I have to say I am a fan of fake meat. And they have really great fake meat there and they have the prawns and the rotisserie chicken and um, lots of like juicy delicious things. The next place we're going to is a place called One Love and it's an entirely vegan restaurant as well. It specializes in like Caribbean food, roti stuff and uh, I have to say, it's one of my favorite vegan restaurants in the city. Hey, Carl, thank you for taking us here. What are we going to so get excited. today? Uh, I'm going to strongly recommend the TVP roti because TVP their TVP roti. is just like, it's unreal. Texturized uh, vegetable protein is where it's at here in Toronto. Uh, and then I'm going to suggest some Kalaloo on the side. Kalaloo? Can we say that together? Kalaloo. you live like right around the corner from that practically but while our food is digesting and we're getting ready to go to Sadie's which I'm also really excited about and I've heard amazing things about I want you to tell everyone about maximum tolerated dose so maximum tolerated dose is a film that's looking at the issue of animal experimentation or vivisection and trying to look at it from a little bit of a different angle than what you would expect so instead of really focusing on a lot of gory footage or things like that I'm interviewing people who have worked in labs and trying to also tell the stories of animals uh, that have been in labs uh, and who have made it out, but also talking about animals who are just in labs, not ignoring them, but trying to tell the story, yeah, in a bit, in a bit of a different way uh, to give people a new perspective on, on like a pretty well-worn issue, I think. So we'll keep our eyes out for that in 2012. And now I think I'm just about digested enough to go to Sadie's. What do you think? Sounds good to me. I love Toronto! <laughs> this is the best place in Toronto to go for a vegan breakfast. So much fun here. Delicious every time. Al is the owner of Sadie's Diner here in Toronto. Al, what's your favorite menu item? I guess the vegan rancheros. Vegan rancheros. You heard it here first. Yes! <laughs> This is the vegan huevos rancheros. With diet cheese. Que bueno! <laughs> Go ahead, it? dig in. Look at this, this is a monster, a monster amount of food. Mm. Breakfast, mm. any time of the day. This is awesome. Mm. Wow. Mm. Yes. Blueberry cheesecake is where it's at. Mm. Oh my god. That's killer right there. Mm. Mm. While you still eat your meal, and we're is, gonna just this eat this. This is still good. <laughs> still good. Joanne, tell us about We Animals. Uh, it's a really long-term photo project mm -hmm. about uh, our relationships with animals around the globe. 
and it takes me all over the place, six, seven months a year. And um, usually photographing unhappy situations, but I try and balance that a little bit, the sanctuary work and the good things happening as well. Well, you take amazing breathtaking photos and it's just so incredible to get to meet you in person and to share this cake with you, which I might not really share with you. <laughs> So the place we're going to now is called Hogtown Vegan. I can't wait for the Caesar salad because it's really hard to get a good Caesar salad vegan one anywhere, really. So they have them there. I have it every single time. It's juicy, it's big, yum. Fake bacon on it and everything. I'm actually looking forward to the, the un-chicken and waffles. At Hogtown? Uh, yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. It's like I am an unending abyss for food because I'm suddenly hungry again. And I'm about to have this waffles and un chicken that you've made me order. <laughs> Poor thing. Poor thing. And it's got like smaller healthiness and deep fried chicken. Mm -hmm. Un chicken. Hello. Unreal. Happiness. Well, it's been five minutes. <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> What about you guys? Starving. starving. We're here at Fressen. I've heard so many great things about Fressen. Hogtown was amazing, but let's see what Fressen has to offer. It's one of our high-end vegan restaurants here in Toronto, and they have a new menu. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Even the bread. Even the bread at Fressen. Mm. So what is this? This is eggplant manicotti. Eggplant manicotti with cashew cheese is where my heart's at right now, at Fresnit here in Toronto. And this is the um, phyllo pastry. Inside it is a cashew cream with mushrooms. And they have a spinach puree with other little sauces in here. I kind of always order this because it's perfect every time. Yep. And there you go. The amazing vegan eating tour of Toronto. You've got to see this for yourself. This was just the tip of the iceberg. And for the first time ever, I can safely say that I am full. You've got to try this out for yourself. Visit Toronto, see all the vegan eats it has to offer. Wow.